guys, KJ here. Welcome back to my channel. Guys, let's start off today with a question of the day. Let me turn to the right page. Okay, it's question of the day, guys. What is your top beauty tip? What is something that you kind of live by? So I'll go first. My top beauty tip is to take multivitamins every day. Um, sometimes I do fall off the bandwagon with taking a multivitamin, but so far I've been pretty good. And I've gotten one of those pill organizers so that each day I remember what pills I want to take for the day and what vitamins. So that is one of my beauty tips. Um, I was just talking to my mother about this and, you know, saying if I could tell people who are in their 20s one thing to live by that I know now, um, I would definitely tell people just to take care of what you're naturally born with. Um, I know like your teeth, your hair, your skin. Take care of those things because those are things that you cannot get back. Yes, you can get veneers, but they're expensive. And who has time for all of that, okay? Um, same thing with your hair, you know, your edges, all that stuff. Just take care of your own body um, through working out, whatever it is that you need to do. So that is my tip of the day. Let's get into this, okay? I was holding off on some of these items because I was waiting for a handbag to be delivered from Coach. And y'all, like, the shipping lately from Coach has been, like, ridiculous. A bag I'm going to show you guys in not too long. Um, I ordered back in, like, I want to say December, mid-December, and I'm just now getting this purse, y'all. I don't know what they're doing over there. They used to have really good shipping, but anyway... So we're going to start off with um, two North Face jackets that I recently got. One North Face jacket was a gift um, and I was so happy about this gift. So one was a gift and once I got this one, I went back and reordered a second one because I was like, this jacket is so good. So this is called the North Face Shelby Rascal Hoodie in the color Wild Ginger. And I like this hoodie, y'all, because it is fleeced lined and it is lined all the way through the sleeve. So it is just really, really cute. And it has a hoodie, which is another thing I like about it. So I'm gonna put this on. And I will say, guys, that it does run a bit, I'm gonna pull this back a little bit. It runs a bit small. So I will leave a link for this in the description box, just in case you wanna look at it. They did have a really good sale and sometimes you're able to catch these jackets for 50% off. Um, so if you're interested in this jacket, please look on the website. And so as you can see, there's two pockets here that zip, okay? And then it has like the North Face symbol, and then it has the hoodie in the back, but it's super, super cute. So I got this one for a gift, and I was trying to like, I pulled some handbags from my closet, because I was like, now what handbags do I have to kind of complement this um, North Face jacket? So I pulled out this one. This is, um, what are these called? Hold on. I'm having like a brain freeze, not the speed. That's right, this bag is called the Rowan, okay? So I got this Rowan when Miss Percival had one of her sales. Um, she was selling a few handbags. So this was one of the Rowans that I purchased. But not with this scarf, but I'm thinking like this could go really nicely with this jacket. So I'll definitely be carrying this one with this. Um, and I'm also going to do a Rowan collection because this I bought two for Miss Percival. And then I have like, I want to say three other Rowans at this point. Um, so I, soon I will get a chance to do a video on all of my Rowans. But this one I'm going to likely carry with this jacket. And then also, this was a old Louis Vuitton that I had. And I don't remember the name of this shape, but it's called the Mini Lin. Like, the print was the Mini Lin. But, guys, I'm thinking about carrying this with this as well. And, of course, like, some black jeans. These jeans are, like, way too casual, but just something a little bit nicer. And I just thought that would look cute as well. And then I also pulled out this little bag, which is, I think it's called the Lane Mini. So I will definitely carry this one with this as well. So I was really happy to get this jacket because I was like, there's so many different bags I could carry with it um, without having to um, find a bag or make it hard to um, find something. 
But y'all, I went and purchased another purse because when I saw this bag on the website, I was like, oh, this is gonna be really cute. And it just so happened that it complimented this jacket. Um, and it is matching this scarf that I have on today. So, this one was shipped, it came in today, y'all. And like I said, it took forever, but it is here. And I will show it to you guys. I picked this one. It is a Molly tote. I picked this one because I don't have a Molly tote yet. I do have a few Rowans, like I said. So this did come in the Rowan print. And y'all, they did they just squish the... Y'all, they are shipping things like... Okay, it still has these little plastics on it. But they did not put the... What you call it on it. So that's probably why it took so long for them to even ship it. Is because they didn't have it at the factory outlet or the warehouse. This probably shipped from like an actual store. And I don't know, now that I'm looking at y'all, I don't know if I'm gonna like contact them because certain parts of it is like kind of dented in. So I don't know, we'll see. I don't, if I'll put some, I have extra tissue because I don't even think I can find this one online anymore. But I might put some tissue in it to see if it'll kind of change shape. Um, so we'll see. Um, but I definitely do love it. And it matches the scarf perfectly. And once again, it's another bag that I can carry. It's actually really cute. One thing that I'm noticing about this Molly, though, is that compared to, like, the city tote, this thing is, like, kind of stiff. Which is not bad, but I wasn't expecting it to be this, like, hard. But it's still pretty, though. So, anyway, y'all. So, I did get, also... This is the matching wristlet to this. That shipped in a while ago, but I just put it to the side, like waiting for the actual purse. Um, so the other items came very quickly, but the purse was the problem. So this is the matching trio to go with that purse. Or it's actually, it doesn't match it, I wanna say. I want it's just complimentary. Hold on, you'll see. So you see how I said it, it doesn't match it perfectly, but it does complement that uh, Molly tote. And so it comes with three pieces. So it comes with the first one's a red pebbled leather. And then this one is like the coated canvas in this uh, jumbo floral print. And then this pouch, the largest one is the signature um, print. And they do sell another trio that's larger than this. Um, some people didn't like that this, you know, that they're making them smaller now. To me, I don't mind, but I do see how that can be annoying. Like if you think you're buying the original size and then you get this, like the smaller one, you could definitely be annoyed about that. But I actually really like this size um, and I like the colors on here. And I'm just taking all of the paper off the ring because I definitely know I'm going to keep this one. So as you can see... It's not an exact match with the wristlet, but it's definitely complimentary and it definitely will look good inside of here. Um, and then I also ordered off Amazon. I went ahead in anticipation for this bag. I went ahead and got a charm y'all, but I didn't know this charm was so big. So when it came to me, I was like, oh my goodness. So I don't even know how it's gonna look on the bag, but it came with a silver ring and then they also included the gold ring on the bag. Um, since this bag has mostly gold in it, I'm definitely going to keep the gold one on and we can see how it looks now. Oh, that's super cute. Really, really pretty. I was not expecting it to look this good. Really pretty, guys. So, okay, that was everything that I have to match this jacket. Like I said, I went ahead and purchased another color because I was so impressed with this jacket and how warm it is. Like this is, I wouldn't wear this outside if it's like 15 degrees, but this is like when the weather is like anywhere from like 40 degrees to like 65, you're gonna wanna wear something like this because it's lightweight, but that fleece lining throughout of, out the entire jacket is just amazing. And I wanna say, does this any inside pockets? I don't 
see any inside pockets. That would have made it really nice as well. And I don't know why they didn't do that, but I guess they're not gonna fix it because the jacket sells so well as it is. They don't have to even add that feature, but that's definitely a feature I would have liked to see was like an inside pocket in case you wanna hide something in there, but still a very nice jacket nonetheless. So I went ahead and ordered the same jacket, but in the color blue. And some, North Face can be expensive, but they have sales every now and then, especially if you sign up for their email. So this is, this better be the right size. Hold on. Okay. This one for some reason looked larger than the other one. <clears throat> so this is the blue color. Um, and what is, it's not called blue. Hold on. I saw a tag on here. Okay. So this is folk blue is called. But anyway, really, really pretty. And when I saw this one, I was like, okay, I can, I know what I'm already like, what bags I'm gonna carry with this one. And you guys will see in a second because they're bags that I previously um, showed on this channel. And I'm gonna take the scarf off because that just doesn't match the, the look right now. <laughs> so anyway, same gist guys, same idea, blue, same exact features, and it covers the bottom just a little bit, okay? So, guys, oh, it's so nice and warm. Okay, anyway, so the bags that I already had, you guys remember, do y'all remember the city tote? So I'm thinking, like, to carry this with the city tote would look really, really cute. So for the most part, y'all, I, I pretty much got the color that would match with items that were already in my closet. Like I purchased this bag, but it wasn't totally because it matched that jacket. It's because I really liked it. But you know, just trying to find, like if you get something new, try to find a color that already goes with your wardrobe. Like I don't have a lot of like yellows and um, what other color, like orange. So I wouldn't go and buy like a jacket that's that color because I have nothing else to go with it. I would have to buy extra stuff to go with that item. So I also have, I don't know if some of y'all remember this, who have been following me for a while now, was this bag right here, which I got from the Kate Spade outlet. But I'm thinking this would look nice with it as well. Or if you wanted to do a bit of a crossbody, that looks cute as well and super, super warm. So guys, I am so excited about this. Um, I'm definitely gonna be wearing this, that's cute, sometime soon because it is warm enough. And I do like that the cut is nice. It's not, but I feel like on camera, it's not really doing it justice, but it is tailored. It's not like, uh, like oversized. Um, and so the medium that I got fit, but like I said, even if you look at the reviews, they tell you the size up in this jacket and you do because the jacket, you need a little bit of space. I have a sweatshirt under here. Um, so it's perfect and giving me space to put other items under this and layer. Okay. So I have my 13 inch MacBook and I'm going to see, okay. It fits in there perfectly guys. So definitely is enough space for that. And I could probably also fit a iPad, wow, and a journal. And all of this is just in the back compartment. So there's nothing in the zipper compartment or nothing in the front yet. Um, and so that is actually really spacious and you it doesn't even like look like you have all that stuff in there. So that's one benefit of this bag. Overall, it's a really nice bag. I just didn't expect it to be stiff, as stiff as it is compared to like the city tote, it's really floppy. This city tote looks a little bit more structured because inside of it, I do have one of those shapers in there. Um, but I guess that's why they made it so structured is because you definitely couldn't fit a uh, base shaper in here, or any type of bag, um, what are those things called, bag inserts. Um, so maybe that is why they made it so structured, but. The colors, y'all, are really gorgeous and vivid. They did an awesome job with this color. Really, really pretty. There's no feet at the bottom, which I'm not upset about. Um, it is nice to have the feet at the bottom, but I don't put my handbags on the floor at all. So, I don't know. I'll be okay without it. 
but overall really great bag and then let's just quickly look at the wristlets as well so in this part the larger wristlet it has those compartments on the inside to hold your cards and i always like these trios i see nothing wrong with these they're gorgeous um the medium sized one let's see does it have anything in there okay this is interesting it has um slots for your cards as well in here it's like two two slots in here so that's nice i think my other one only had like card slots in the largest one and so let me see if the smaller one has any um compartments in it so the smaller one does not have any card slots or anything but a card can fit in here very easily and i do like how you can take all of these pieces off and you still have this cute little red wristlet um anyway you slice or dice it it looks gorgeous okay so guys super super cute and i know right now um you probably could still find this if you call like the store i think it's sold out online but you could probably call a store and see which store has it in stock um now they have the cherry heart print out and i believe it's in the same size and i think that's really cute as well um but we'll see if i get the other the cherry heart one i'm not quite sure yet but we'll see um, okay, guys, that is it for today's haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you in the next video. Please like and subscribe. Bye, guys.